today we are going to start making our sketchbooks. Today we are going to start making our sketchbooks and we are just going to start making the inside. Um, if you can see up in here, uh, you can kind of tell that there are five different sets of paper that eventually we will glue together. Each one of these sections is called a signature. And today our only job is to make five signatures. And next week we will learn how to glue it into our sketchbook. So in your art kit, you had a stack of paper some of it was colored, some of it was white. You should have 25 sheets of paper. You're also gonna need your string and a scissors for today. So to start, you're going to have to fold every sheet of paper. And you wanna fold it in half and really give it a good crease on the end. Uh, you could probably fold, I would say two at a time. I don't know if I would do much more than that. Once you start to fold a lot of sheets of paper together, they, they'll stick out, they just don't fold as well. So go ahead and fold all of your sheets of paper. All right, you have all of your paper folded. We are going to put them into five signatures or five groupings. You can do that however you want with the colored paper. This could all be one group or you could um, mix it in with your white paper, which is what I'm gonna do. So I have one sheet of paper, I'm gonna open it up, slide in the next one. That's two. I'm gonna put in a colored one. Three. Right, so I have three in here and I need two more. I want two more white ones. One. Two. So I made a little booklet with five sheets of paper. I need to make four more of those. So again, one, two, three, four, five. So I have two signatures, I have three more to go. Okay, I have one, two, three, four, five groups of paper, each with five sheets of paper. And now we wanna bind them together. And this is where we're gonna use our scissors and string. And so I think the best way to do this is to keep my string all together. You should have extra, um, but this is just me being cautious. And then I'm gonna open it up to the middle where I can see my crease. I'm gonna put that string in there and I'm gonna close it, okay? And then I'm gonna tie a knot over here. And I want it to be tight so that the paper stays together, but I don't want it to be so tight that my paper starts to curl. So this looks good. I tied a knot. And then I'm gonna tie, I always like to do double or triple knots. That's just for me. So a double knot, and then I can 
trim it. And I don't wanna cut it right at the knot. I wanna leave a little bit of tail, but I can also trim that side down too. You have completed one signature. So this will be ready to put into the sketchbook. We need to do this four more times. I'm gonna go through it once more. I have my string. I'm open all the way to the middle. I make sure it's in the crease and then I close it. And then I'm gonna tie a knot. This is where you might want some help, an extra finger to help you hold the knot down, but you can also do it without any help. That's kind of, ooh. See how that one got really loose? So, I'm gonna retie that one. Still using the same string, it's just gonna have an extra knot. That's okay. So maybe pull it tight and kind of hold. Much better. <laughs> Let's double knot it now. Cut off the tails. This one has that extra tail. There we go. All right, I have three more to go. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna finish that. All right, I have my five signatures. One, two, three, four, five. They are tightly together. Uh, we are not gonna glue them or anything today, but next week, oops, there they are. Next week, we'll glue them into our folder. So what you could do is this half folder that you got, you could just go ahead and fold it in half. I would tuck my signatures in here, and then I would go ahead and just slide it right into my art kit. So it's in here and ready to go when uh, you're in class next week or at home next week. I have a little bit of extra string. I wanna keep that too, just in case I need it for another project we do or I could use it somehow. And those little scraps you could get rid of. All right, great job.